It's the Shanghai Show.com, and uh, today we're headed to the wet market. I assume that says wet market. Jianghua Lu and Taiyuan Lu. Many all over the town. This is one of my favorite. Uh, we, we often talk about talk about a lot of the uh, the tourist traps here in town, but this is actually one of the cool things to uh, take a walk through. This is where the locals go uh, daily to pick up uh, things like beans. I think those are beans. The screen's small. I'm sorry. Uh, what else you have? A bit of noodles, maybe some rice on your right. There's, that's actually seafood. Shanghai being a, a seafood town. To the left, you've got somebody cutting what looks like mackerel, I assume. And uh, what else we got here? Veggies. Lots of veggies. Um, what else to say? I just, I don't know. I'm not going to name all the vegetables. I think you know those for yourself. And I don't know them in Chinese, which means there's not a lot to say other than take a look. A lot cheaper to get them here than, say, going to, like, uh, Carrefour or the, uh, the shopping market underneath Jing'an Temple. And you're supporting local people instead of a huge company. Uh, fruit, veggies, anything you need. Um, what else we have? This little place up here on the right, they go ahead, they, they prepare meat for you. So this is already cut. as a baby. Bow, bow. Uh, they prepare meat for you. So what you have is sliced beef, sliced chicken, chicken feet, uh, of course. Uh, drunken shrimp, things of that sort. And up here we have more vegetables and more vegetables, and it's not getting monotonous. Okay, here we go. Some noodles. Mian. I probably said that wrong. Wrong tone. What else we have? More rice, more noodles. They'll make the noodles fresh right there in front of you. That's why it's a cool place to kind of go and watch. And uh, here we have the, uh, the section of doom and despondence and despair. This is where you get your, uh, you pick out your duck or chicken, and uh, they kill it, feather it, boil it for you. Uh, a second before I filmed this, they just uh, got done doing that, so kind of be glad I was late. And uh, here are the chickens that you can choose to have killed in front of you. Barbaric as it sounds, uh, they're fresh. They'll do anything you want, cut them up. Get some keys made while your chicken's being choked or killed. Um, what else we have? More seafood. Shanghai crabs are actually in season, so you're, you're going to see a lot of crabs if you're here in the fall. More crabs, more fish, more fish. I wish I wish this were like an MP5 and you could, you could smell it because the stench is kind of overwhelming, but it's all part of the process. And clams, all out of the Huangpu River, which is why I kept on walking. More veggies. Great place to get some, uh, if you're a photographer here, the light is amazing. Uh, dark, except for the light right over the vegetables you see there, and the colors just really come out gorgeous. So if you like taking pictures, this is definitely a place to come. Some balsa, a bit of bread, some grapes. And there you go. It's, uh, it's part of the local culture. I highly suggest making this one of your stops. It's the wet market. It's the uh, Shanghai show, and uh, I guess... We will see you back tomorrow. Bye.